I've had a blast. I hope you have too. Thanks for watching. And I will see you out there when I'm running this car. Good deal. Good stuff. See you now. Bye now. Be a part of uh, Steve O.D.'s 313 Build Dolls if you can. They're they just a, they are so much fun. They are a blast. So, good stuff. Good deal. I am out of here. You totally want me to get my race car. Yeah, I get it. You bet. Perfect. 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 <laughs>
the red foam bumper holder, the nuts for the wheels. What am I missing? There's, oh yeah, the, the bevel gear shafts as well. Um, they are in red and of course the shocks. Again, just extremely, extremely pleased with how well this TTO2 turned out. Um, definitely like doing this and I look forward to doing it more in the future. Uh, thanks Steve-O from the 313 for getting me into this. Thank you all for watching. Thank you. Hey guys, welcome back to Tamiya Legends. This is our next build, which is going to be the Tamiya Top Force. Right, that's the best battery died, guys. Well, that was awesome. Yeah, just, I don't know what to say. It's absolutely fantastic buggy. Where are you going? Where are you going? 
Just wanted to do a quick running video just to show people that it's under its own power. Four wheel steering. Just wanted to give you guys a little show of how fast. Not that fast, but I mean, here's reverse. About the same. But yeah, direct drive on that guy, so pretty cool. What's up everybody, it's your boy Steve OD from the 313, wait, I forgot to do it, 313, coming at you with another video. Happy to me a Tuesday. Here we have the Top Force, the 2017 re-release edition. This is uh, for build off number five. Steve OD from the 313, to me off build off number five, completed. Um, uh, this is a really cool kit. Like I was saying, it's got the fiberglass reinforced uh, chassis, shock towers, upper deck brace. It's got thick, thick A-arms here. Um, Solid. Uh, they're two-piece arrows, but they're a solid design. Um, really, really beefy. Um, it's got CVDs, and that's what's really cool. Is uh, in 1990 they had CVDs on this, and that was something that was um, also top-notch racing stuff for the time. See the drive shaft work. That's just a 2S little. Um, Little run. Um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna run it on 3S though, as well. Oh man, my batteries. The batteries in my transmitter are low. But this thing's ripping it up. 
Maybe I'll put some music so you don't hear that beeping sound. Sorry about that, guys. Put your batteries in this. Rally TTO2 finished. I am very happy the way this thing came out. I think it looks incredible. There were a few stickers that you had to put on. Nothing crazy. So that is about it, guys. My build off number five is done. Big thanks to Steve OD from the 313 for putting these builds together. They've been so much fun to do. Hello folks, welcome to Netcruiser RC. This is gonna be another Tamiya Tuesday. I need to work on my next Tamiya kit. This is gonna be my announcement video of what I'm building for Steve OD 313 RC Build Off 5. And this is all just kind of worked out because he's doing only Tamiya kits and he's doing open choice kits for the last two builds. So for build four, I did the racing truck. And for build five, well, if you've watched me enough, you know that I'm more of a racer than a basher, although I still do both. Uh, I spend a lot of my time on race vehicles, racing on road. I'm going to be trying to do mostly Tamiya. So I picked up this a few months ago and I have yet to even unbox the cellophane or anything. This is the Tamiya TA07 Pro. That's what I'm doing. Build off five is Tamiya TA07 Pro. TA07 Pro. This is what it looks like. Here we go. Boom. Isn't that awesome? That's really good looking car, man. So I don't know if you noticed before, but I used to have this body shell hanging up in the back and it was always an intention to turn it into a race car and here it is. All right, USGT C main. I'm in the C again. Oh, I hate starting first. <laughs> the pressure. Thank you.